Penn State men's basketball finished last season under 500 for the third straight year. Today, Pat Chambers simply said we should be better. Ashley Chase tells us who might make that possible for the Lions. Last season, it was easy for the Nittany Lions to know that the one-two punch would be Tim Frazier and DJ Newbill. Well, a lot has changed since then. Tim Frazier graduating, DJ Newbill stepping into a bigger leadership role to lead the Lions. Newbill from the elbow. Newbill watched his squad struggle late in games last season and looked no further than himself to find an answer. I think sometimes last year I kind of um, strayed off because, you know, we had Tim being one of the most vocal guys on the team. Um, and I realized, you know, maybe too late that he needed my help um, for our leadership. Um, so this year I'm going to try to be, you know, more vocal. Uh, more hands-on leader um, than I ever was. I think DJ is becoming more of a, a vocal leader, and guys are definitely looking at him to lead. And you know, as well, DJ has spent this entire season, you know, obviously working on his game, but but leadership as well. That shift in leadership didn't stop with Newbill, Ross Travis, Brandon Taylor, and Penns Valley grad Kevin Montminy, all captains on this team. Pat Chambers says they've taken more ownership of the Lions. And I think we have a great understanding of what. Our, our, our approaches in practice, our approaches for games, our approaches for anything that we do. And that takes a long time to put together. Is it, is it where I really want it to be? No. There's still so much growth to go, but it's, it's getting there. That ownership isn't just in the locker room. These players know they have more to give on the court. At the Bryce Jordan Center, Ashley Chase, Six Sports.